Dante. Standing cover. It's been a while, but we're gonna do this. So I wanna basically be any reason. Hey, it's my YouTube channel, I do whatever the fuck I want. I don't have to do nothing. I don't wanna. So it goes up. It's not gonna be enough for anything, I don't think. No, it's not enough for anything. I'm just gonna say fuck it and we're just gonna run in. I keep meaning to get to like the end of Bloody Palace and record like any progress as if it's a story mode, but it means I have to go through like an hour of content each time. Oh yeah, it's a custom music like that. Why is it kicking? Yeah. It's very hard to do anything cool at this point. Come here! Come here! I'm just not really doing anything really exciting at this point. Let me lower the volume a little bit. There we go. The music's cool, I don't want to raise it a little bit. But I don't want it to drown out my voice. Ow. Oh, so let me pay attention. I don't want to be styled on my little bugs. What the fuck do I have equipped? There we go. Don't want this. On this. There we go. That's the thing. Oh, this is embarrassing. There we go. So let me just get into the swing of things. I love this. I love this weapon so much I named my cat after it. Often people say, where did you get Balrog's name? And everyone's first thing is, oh, the boxer from, uh, oh, well, fuck you, buddy. This asshole. What the dick tits? <laughs> How am I this bad? Come on, I can't lock onto shit and I'm just taking hits. Come on. Come on. Oh, fuck you then. Just gonna keep hitting them until they die. This is embarrassing. I'm losing health to bats. Ugh. Actually, like, the last thing I played was a Nero, so yeah, this is probably not, like, high styling shit here, but he's, I'm pretty sure he says gotta go fast, and I want to think that he's making a Sonic reference. I know he's not. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's because I had the wrong finger equipped. So I was like, why can't I do the, the sword shit? And it's because it literally wasn't the sword master. No, we did a thing. It's just time consuming on enemies that you could just hit a few times, but whatever. I'm just doing the thing. Oh, hello. Come on, love, show us your weak point. <laughs> what did that come to my mind? <laughs> it sounds so fucking slutty. It's like the sleaziest thing I've ever said. <laughs> oh, come on, love, just show us your weak point. <laughs> Is it too targetable? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, well, coops on me for having, like, literally all the slowest build-up weapons at once. Yeah, it's been, a, it's been a whole, it's been a hot minute. Yeah, let's just, let's just shoot the weakest gun in the game at these armored bastards. Yeah, that was cool, shut up. Slow down. Yeah. Bring up 
break down to your shield off, bish. Like a bish. Oh, look at these stage times. I am gonna time out <clears throat> if I don't build this shit up. So let's just focus. It's like, oh, it's you. Change to punch, change to punch. Oh, shit. Change to punch. Oh, fuck it. Let's just forget about it. Oh, I'll just miss. Let's just, let's just miss. This, this just fuck up so spectacularly. You can tell I've been playing a lot of Doom Eternal lately because I just don't know how to play this game anymore. Because, you know, it's a lot of hot swapping in both of them. It's like, da 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 da, -da you gotta do all this stuff. Ah, change everything. Ah. Let's just, let's just bank some of this D DT. I should have done this earlier. There. Now I can build standard DT again. Oh, I'm mean, gonna just get fucking wrecked by the first thing. Use your basic combo. Gotta do comp. Ah! <laughs> hey, his corpse was blocking my trick. What the shit? Is that even a thing, or am I just bad? Die, die, die. Thank you. I wanted to do the slow, cool guy thing, and I'm just not having the chance here. Uh, do the thing. That's not the thing. Gotta do the dank macabre. Do I even have the dank on this? Oh, fuck it. I do know I have this. Gotta do the drive, drive, overdrive. <clears throat> so I was gonna use this as my platform to critique. The horrible Devil May Cry anime that I was watching. There was only one. And anybody who tries to, like, you know, say to you that it's, like, one of the better parts of the Devil May Cry canon, they're the kind of people who think that Devil May Cry made the wrong turn ever since one. Because it really has the same vibes as one and two. Which are not like what I like about Devil May Cry. Sorry for liking wacky bullshit that's fun and entertaining to watch and is of some, you know, not just grim Van Helsing ripoff where everyone has depression and is too cool for school. Too cool to fucking emote. At, at all. Yeah, I'm too fucking cool. Yeah. Just like, it comes across as like, edgy teen drama where everyone's just too unfazed by everything. So what would happen if you had a Brooklyn Nine-Nine episode where everyone was replaced with Rosa? You'd think, oh, that would sound really cool. No, it'd just be a room full of people not emoting and refusing to say anything other than edgy cool guy shit. And it would just, eventually, it's like, why isn't this anime just pure Jotaro from beginning to end? It's like, because nothing would get done. You need people to bounce off of people. That's why personalities exist. Yeah. The Devil May Cry anime consists of Dante not emoting, Morrison being disappointed in him, and basically fulfilling the Jet Black role in this anime because it was trying kind of quite a lot to be like the same kind of stylish thing, like well shot kind of thing, like Cowboy Bebop was kind of trying to be, but managed to do so much better. I don't know what I'm doing here, by the way, I'm just fucking up the time here. Just fucking die. I'm just hitting buttons, so it's not like a surprise that took longer than it should. Yeah, oh my god, I could just, I, I literally wrote three A5 pages when I finished the Devil May Cry anime, because it was bugging me. It was bugging me super hard as to, why don't I like this thing? And it was mostly, it's just like it missed the mark on so many things, and I could see what it was going for, but it just missed everything that it was trying to do. Oh shit, that was a bad time for a wind-up move. Yeah, fuck you too, buddy. Oh yeah, I got an unbreakable... There you go. Dick. 
Yeah. <laughs> well, that's what I get. Ah. You did a lot of damage, buddy. Am I on a higher difficulty level than I remember? Like, some Sparta or something? I don't remember. Doesn't matter. We're just gonna hit the game until I, until I win. Oh man, like, I wanted to like it so much. I went in with people actually saying, it's not that bad, it's pretty good for a video game anime. And to be fair, for anime that's based off of a video Ooh, you little... Now my cat is jumping out of the toilet. His toilet. Not just anybody. Uh, let's just fiddle around with the guns for a bit. If you can't work out what Morriston's saying, he says work off that dead son at that point. It would have been cool. Look at all the meters I'm not using. Oh Jesus, I'm bad at this game. <clears throat> yeah, no, I was like, way to just make like. There's a lot of like, there's a lot of stuff where it's like, you. They were clearly put under a lot of restrictions, and like, you can't have Dante do this. You can't have Dante do that. And it had to be signed off by Capcom or something, because it felt like there was just nothing going on for a lot of it. Like, they were trying so hard to make something interesting, and they just managed to make something very tropey and very uninteresting to watch. That had a lot of cool, like, sound effects and stuff, and it felt really stylish to watch the, intro the opening and the ending. I don't think I have Dance Macabre yet, because I've tried to play out a few times and I think I've just fucked up the input. Oh, there it is. Just because I was at a weird angle, sometimes I find it hard to do the back and forth when he's facing in a diagonal position. He keeps blocking it. <laughs> I'm smart. That's why I'm doing minus 30 seconds on every fucking level and running out of time like crazy on the beginning rounds. So we're just going to massacre this guy. Or we're just going to trick him in place because we're idiots. We're just going to have everything equipped incorrectly. Oh shit. Well that worked. <laughs> That was the one I was planning on doing, but fine. DT fucking OP gun blazer, why not? Uh, anyway, um... Oh man, I could just, I could just spend the entire bloody palace run talking about... Like, I don't want to just piss on it. There were things I liked, like the, the poker episode, and like... The way they handled the character makes sense. It's just that the way some people talked about it was like it was like integral to the storyline. Like it tells you so much about Dante's character. And it does not. It does not. It does nothing. It plays it safe. It throws a few tidbits of dialogue in there that then just don't add anything. But at one point they're like, some guy comes out and always says, Hey, are you Tony? And he's like, what? No, I'm not Tony. And then he's like, ha, psych, I was called Tony once, but I'm not the Tony he's looking for, and that's it. And everyone goes, oh my god, yeah, that was his secret. And like, it's actually in DMC5, this game, that they actually start talking about the whole Tony Redgrave shit. It's really more mentioned here in Morrison's letters than it is in anything else. Uh, this one. There you go. Gotta get, gotta get the hang of this shit. I feel my playstyle's completely changed into 
garbage. <clears throat> so, uh, what was I saying? Um, yeah, like, everyone makes out like, oh, yeah, like, there's loads of people critiquing it and saying, oh, it proves Dante has depression because he does this. And it's like, I think it's just the writers were scared of showing them, like, trying to do anything with the character in his downtime. And we're like, what does Dante do in his downtime? I don't fucking know. He eats Sundays and he looks depressed. Because they were like, probably were basically saying, if we show him doing, like, I don't know, playing with a Rubik's Cube, somebody will get upset. Like, you know? Oh, that's better. Doing the boring slave, easy slave combo shit. Working, but it's probably less entertaining, but... <laughs> oh, I'm doing my big fancy intro pose, it's like... Ah, I pressed the button too much. No, oh, this one. Gun. Two gun. Oh. Ass. <laughs> Just Royal Guard got a massive buff in this game. And I didn't even really use Royal Guard in 4. So... Yeah, even I know that this is just buffed as shit. Like, you just hold the button down now and it'll do it. Yeah, you can time it, but if you want to deal with this guy and you can't, you're lazy or you're LP and you can just hold the button down and it doesn't really matter. It just trivializes that character because it's only just block, shoot. And I know I didn't do that once in that encounter, but it would have trivialized it a lot faster. <coughs> Yeah, like, it really, it felt like the creators wanted to do something and were told at every point. And then we're just like, well, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> like, you know, it felt like that. No, this guy. Yeah. I will kill the, 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 the orbs. Need that extra time because I was a twat and you don't know how to play the game. Really? The boss already? I thought it was like more vines. Oh, okay. Now I'm gonna have to really learn how to play the game really fucking quickly. Uh, a shotgun. Great. There. Get shot at. I'm still playing Doom. <laughs> Shoot demon with gun. Ugh. Just use sword. Okay, a motorcycle, there you go. That's what I get for trying. <laughs> well, I missed. Well, I missed. Oh. Friend? Friend? This is my friendship gum. <laughs> He's mad. Luckily that staggered him or he hit the statue or something. No! Don't eat the car! I'm on fire I'm behind here, you can't get me now. I will taunt. Stopped him using his move. <laughs> he was just like, oh, he hid behind the wall. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> just stop. Ah. <laughs> oh, did I make that? Some damage. 
Oh, yeah, you can. very good. Very nice, we're all impressed. You can eat cars. Well, that deleted most of his health bar, so... Oh, no, we'll, we'll lock on in a minute. There we go. <laughs> oh, he's mad. <laughs> he's pissed. I mean, I did just drown him in rockets, so... <laughs> yeah. Gotta do that style switch shit. <laughs> Just shoot electric up his ass. That'll teach him. Oh. Rude. Oh, this shit. Well, I don't have enough DT to deal with this, and he's gonna flip on me, isn't he? Yep. Just gonna. We're just gonna. We're just gonna. <laughs> no! <laughs> Fucking debris. Oh no! No! Are oh, you with that stupid projectile of his? That's the that's the thing that always kills me because it's very high damaging, and I'm dumb. And the big red comet coming at me, I just go, oh yeah, I better eat that. Uh, why didn't trick work? Oh, okay, fuck you then. Good work, asshole. And thus ends another fail. Well, this is embarrassing. Yeah. Big old D. <laughs> yeah, I'm an idiot. Shall we try with Nero and see if I do any better? I mean, it's just a bit of a laugh. I'm not really messing around too much and taking it too seriously. Um, just for the lols, and so I can talk about how pissed off I am about the Devil May Cry enemy. Uh, it's not even that it was annoying me, it was just like, I, I don't know what I was going in expecting, you know? And then it was irking me, and I was like, what's wrong with it? Let's just try and cannibalize it and work out why I hate it. Or, it's not even that I hate it, it's just I was a bit disappointed. The combat is one of the big things that I, like, noted down was the problem. <clears throat> uh, action game that is all about... Oh, let's have some tomboy. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't like that one. I do like this one, but I'm not very good at using it. Punchline's handy. Overture's pretty neat. Raw height's fine, I just uh, uh, I just I just gonna do the ones what I always use. Uh no. No I don't need the buster on I have Devil Traeger. Uh, 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 uh it's fine. Could have been doing this the whole time. Ah. Well, I used to be able to always ace that, so fuck me, I guess. Anywho, uh, yeah. Ah. Come to me, little goblin. And look, I did it much faster, because the, the damage, the damage. But then I just walk straight in with no stacks, so... <laughs> Styling to nobody. So yeah, big things that people talk about. What are the key points that you would say are the most important elements of Devil May Cry. Is it 
that it looks like Van Helsing? Is it that it's stylish and combat oriented? Is it Strawberry Sundays? <laughs> or screaming anime girls with annoying grating voices? Oh yeah, I should just be dragging him to me, not chasing him around. Um, which do you think? Like, <clears throat> because all of the scenes, they should have got an anime studio that knew how to draw combat scenes or animate combat scenes, because all of them are Dante walks in, puts his hand on a gun and or sword, a flash happens, everybody's dead. And it's a nice concept for this is how humans perceive Dante's thing. But then it suggests if he's styling on people, these guys are styling on them and S-ranking things and going, yeah, I'm taunting and doing all of this weird flippy shit like this. And flying around on rocket arms, although that wasn't this era of Devil May Cry. Why they? Oh yeah, on the third one I get the full great. Um, it makes you think why are they even bothering to do it for their own entertainment. Just not even trying her weak point that time, that scissorman thing. Just hitting it until it dies. <clears throat> Ow. No! Ow. Oh yeah, actually use the arms. <laughs> I panicked. So I just started flying. So I'm not very good with these uh, table hopper things. I tried to catch him. Yeah, it's, it's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, like... Um, there's just a lot of stuff in it where it's just like a lot of the voice actors for the English dub as well, which might have just been the dub I was watching, just felt a bit like, hey, hey, you're a fucking prick. <laughs> and it just felt really immature and like Gohan calling, uh, Gohan calling people a retard level of stupidity, where it's like, I don't think Lady talks like that. In fact, they pretty much retconned Lady to be the nicest person on the planet in TMC. Hive. She's unconscious, and then she's like, hi, for the rest of the thing, like, that nice lady that you work with, or that hairdresser you always go to, because she's just the nicest person, and she has, like, really good hair, she's kind of wearing these weird shoulder pads, but, you know, she does the best hair, and she's like, hi, it's you again, oh, yeah, what, what happened lately, and it's just, like, the friendliest motherfucker on the planet. She's not that in the anime. She spends most of the time going, <laughs> "Who's this bitch?" And you to like to like Trish and shit when Trish is introduced, and like it just feels like this is someone who misunderstood or the character just wasn't written yet. Maybe you know, it felt like that. I felt like I came out knowing less about Lady than I do now. Which is weird, because i played this game already. <laughs> like, you know, it actually confused me. <laughs> Don't run. Oh, exactly zero. I should get points for that. Perfect zero. Hey man, just saying. Just super saying. Yeah, I didn't like a lot of it. It's like the way they were drawn. They had really cool uh, clothing options. Like, they were very faithful, but also very, like, designed with high detail. And then for some reason, they did that initial D shit where everybody's frame is non existent and it's all about their clothes. And their clothes are really big. 
and they don't seem to have any like definition of a body. You know, like the protagonist of Initial D looks like he's a t-shirt walking around on a coat hanger because of the way they draw the folds of the clothing. And like, yeah, I can't do better. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, well, I'm being in a critiquey bitchy mood, so shut up. Okay, well, fuck you. Maybe I should dodge more. Maybe you should shut up. I feel like I'm missing a trigger half for him, but maybe not. I can't remember how long it'd be for his devil trigger comes out for. Oh, no, you broke my thing and now I have to learn how to use another thing. Charge shit. Why am I not charging shit? There we go. Oh. Eat dicks. Eat all the dicks. Please die. Oh! I meant, I meant to devil trigger out that. I actually blew his face up with <laughs> fucking another arm, but like they actually restock the arms faster than I'm burning through them, so I'm never gonna get to Tomboy at this rate. See? <laughs> it's like I knew. So, what did I blow up? I blew up. We could just do the same thing, or I could just... Oh, that's the, yeah, let's have a rawhide. Even though I don't really like them. Just, let's just burn through them. Let's just burn through them. Who gives a shit? Uh, yeah, there's just a lot of problems with it. There's a lot of Christ imagery. They literally, in the final act, they have Dante up on a cross. And it feels like no one told them that that was never going to be a plot point for Dante. He is not Christ adjacent. He is literally the opposite. <laughs> like, he's half devil. That really pissed me off for some reason. It's like, especially after the whole Snyder, hey look, Superman's the Jeebus. It's like, oh, I get, you know. Ah. I'm trying to be cool. Fuck you. The world -oh. No. The world -oh. Eight seconds of past, and I'm getting my ass kicked. Stop it! Play nice! Oh, I'll stop time. It's our world, though. <laughs> Just shoot you in your. How many times can I shoot them in the stop time? Twice. Still ran out of time. <laughs> Well, there you go. Stopping time actually worsens my time. Who would have thunk it? Yeah, um, that, the Christ imagery was just unnecessary bullshit that I was just pissed off at. Do the thing. Stay the line. I'll save those two pips for some reason. Yeah! I will continue to make deer references. There's no road roller in this. So I'll just keep throwing him until he gets dizzy. Yeah! Normally ragtime breaks if you spam it. Because it's the whole time the time stop bubble is out. <laughs> that was the dumbest shit. <laughs> that was the dumbest shit I've ever done. He just stands up and punches me in the face with his sword. And I'm just like, 
Oh, and it didn't clash. I didn't get out of the way. I didn't do this. <laughs> and again, it's just fucking taking swords to the face. Oh! This isn't this is bad. This is the worst it's ever been. Oh my god. No. <laughs> no, not again. It's bad. It's it's bad. I can't even pick you up when you're on the floor. Oh, it's because he's raged. Is it because he's raged? Please stop. Oh, by the way, I am hitting the rev all the time, and my timing is just so far off, it's just not. There we go. There you go. Now we're cooking with three bars of gas. Uh, yeah, so, like, there's so much of the anime that pissed me off, personally. And, like, it tells you a lot. It says, this is why you can't write a convincing character-driven anime. When you, like, you know, the game is focusing on people being cool. And people doing cool shit and cool actions. You can do cool shit is basically what they should be putting on the box art. They removed all the cool combat shit because I think straight up the animation studio couldn't articulate a choreography to save their lives. Oh. For some reason I tried to change to trick. <laughs> this guy. And um, all they were told not to, all their budget was too low. I don't know. Don't judge me. I don't know this Korean anime studio that made this thing that I've literally, like, you know, I'm not big on anime. It's like one of the 20 animes I've ever actually bothered to watch. And when your standards are like JoJo and like the really big popular shit <laughs> that everyone's like, he's got all of the budget. You watch, uh, to be fair, I watched Ace Attorney. That anime is pretty funny. But it's really just like, Hey guys, look, Larry Butts is here. <laughs> You're like, haha, this is Larry Butts. Yeah. No, I could go on. I, I'm actually gonna reference. No! No! There you go. Let's reference what else I got pissed off about. Yeah. First thing first Dante's not cool in the anime. Straight up, Dante's really trying to be cool in the anime, anime but he is try hard as fuck in the anime. He's not cool. I'll stop doing that shit. Oh, you poop face. You're a poop nose. Yeah, take that. Helps if I do anything. <laughs> there we go. Work that pole. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! I knew you were coming, Waluigi. I don't know why Waluigi. Okay. Ah, oh, just fuck out of my face. There you go. Now I did the thing. Oh yeah! Everyone shut up, he's playing a guitar. <laughs> this is the best! <laughs> this is the LP now. Oh, does he just keep going? Oh, shit, yeah. <laughs> okay, we better... Nero. Nero. <laughs> it's 
sir. Sir. I don't want to interrupt him almost. You seem so happy. <coughs> yeah, Dante straight up not cool in the anime. There's no Virgil. Ever. Virgil never shows up. And then they kind of hint at Virgil, but don't hint at Virgil, where they're like, hey guys. Oh my god, you know what's gonna happen? Yeah, um, something or other, and you're like, oh, okay, your biggest adversary. And there's a whole thing where they do like a Virgil and Dante adjacent with big flowing anime bishi motherfucker thing where they're like, and Dante's like, I had a brother once. And you're like, that's all I'm getting? Where's Virgil? And they literally never even show Virgil in a flashback. And you're like, oh my god, really? If this is a character-driven, non-combat choreography take on it, why did you take two episodes with Trisha in where she's like, ha ha ha, I was his girlfriend, but then I left because he's a fucking loser. And ladies, and he's like, she meets Lady, and Lady's like, huh. And like, you know, Trish is like, who the fuck is this chick? Dante moves on quickly. And then like, it turns out that they didn't split up. She just ran off to do some like, badass nondescript shit out of the plot. Cause fuck you. And it's all a bit weird. And then it's like, a uh, lady's like, uh, and it's like trying to create some sort of harem anime bullshit. Where you're like, that's not what those characters are. What the dick? And it's just like, okay. And then, I like honestly, it just felt weird where they're like, we were dating and then we weren't. It feels like fanfic. It's like, why even bring it up? I'm barely using raw hide and it's not getting broken as a result. And now we're back at refuel. No. It Boss, then refuel. We're going to be using a lot of these because I have six of them. Ah. Oh. If I can get past the boss. I did the, the Devil Traeger very badly. You really need enemy step for this dude if you're Nero in. Because he doesn't have like the trick out, trick in shit. So you have to keep kind of flying in and flying out. Gerber is really good for this guy. Oh my god. Please. Please. Don't kill me. No. <laughs> Please. Okay, bye. See ya. We'll just charge it while you have a tantrum. Eh, I really want Tomboy, but I'm too much of a stinge. Fuck it. <laughs> Don't wanna break Tom. Like, just fuck you. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna get you. Oh! He shot me with the gun again! <laughs> I'm so pissed! He hit me in the face that time! Please, just let me tomboy a little. Let me- No! No! You- oh! <laughs> You- You're the worst kind of demon. You're the no fun demon. Oh, good. And we're gonna throw him. And then we're... Then we're gonna... There you go! That's the biscuit. It's still on him. I love this. Do you think I could shoot it? Oh, I can't do anything at the moment. It blew up when he hit. Oh, I was hoping I could shoot him as he flew. Oh, that would have been cool. But come on, man. There's only so much you can do. Whoop! 
Go punchy. That's the wrong way. <laughs> oh! <laughs> this is this is nonsense. What am I doing? <laughs> I'm loving it. Oh no! No! Can I resurrect, please? Do, do you have a trig? <laughs> It's the worst, and I'm not getting half the shit I need to say out of the way. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs>